Hi, everyone. Andy Lassner from The Ellen DeGeneres Show. Um, I can't tell you how honored I am to have been asked uh, by Scott and Julie to talk about my experience with mental health, but more importantly, my, my feelings on the importance of the work that's being done with Garrett's space. I have suffered with depression my entire life, real deal depression, not, hey, I'm sad, I'm feeling down. I'm talking about the depression that so many young people have, serious mental health depression where we are in bed. We are looking at life through dark glasses where everything feels sad, even if evidence to the contrary in our lives tells us everything should be good. How can you be sad? We're not sad, we're depressed, or we're dealing with other mental health issues. And I can't tell you how much I wish Garrett's space existed when I was younger. The amount of pain and, and heartache that I went through, not to mention all the heartache and pain you put those who you love through, the people in my life who I've lost due to mental health would so have benefited from a place like Garrett's space. We need to take the stigma out of mental health problems. I love openly talking about it. I am proud to be part of a comedy show and to be known as a really funny person and yet be very, very open to the fact that there have been many times that I don't wanna live. There have been many times that I think the world would be better without me. That I went to the bottom and furnished the bottom of drug addiction as a heroin and cocaine addict, all because I didn't know how to talk about what was happening. I didn't have other people to talk to about it, especially when I was younger. You feel so alone. You feel like there's something wrong with you, and so you medicate however you need to, with food, with drugs, with whatever, and you don't just say, hey, friend, you and I have something very in common. We see the world through darkness, and let's work together to see it in a more lighter way. And that is the work that's being done by Garrett Space. There is nothing more heartbreaking than what happened to Garrett. Losing someone to suicide, especially a child, is a pain that I can't even imagine. But to take that pain the way Scott and Julie have and turned it around and created something that is so important for people, it's all about community. The, the, the key to depression and getting better from it is not being alone. My depression wants me alone. My depression wants me isolated. My depression wants me feeling bad for myself. But when I'm here talking to you guys and talking to other people about mental health and the fact that we can overcome and work on it together, depression and mental illness doesn't like that. They don't want us to congregate. They don't want us to all be working together. And that's why what we're doing here today with Garrett Space is so important. I beg you $5, $100, anything, volunteer time, anything you can give to this, incredible, incredible work that's being done with Garrett Space, um, I implore you to. Um, whatever you can, anything helps. And please, please, please be open about mental health struggles. If you're someone who has the influence of anyone, you have anybody looks up to you in your life, and that's anybody, a child, anything, be open that you're struggling with mental health. You cannot believe how many lives you're saving by just saying, you know what? My brain is telling me something that isn't true. Does that ever happen to you? You will be amazed how many people will not only relate with that, but just by you talking about your own struggles and other people who are, are struggling with mental health, talking out loud and taking the stigma away, it will, it will help save lives. I promise you that. Um, anyway. I'm tired of my own voice. I've gone on long enough. Love you guys, and please support Garrett Space any way you can. Thank you.